I'd f***ing rather cut my foot off than be a vegan. I'd f***ing eat myself before I freaking sit around and eat vegetables. Everyone wants bacon and chicken and cheese and yep. f***ing beef because they're selfish and greedy and that's all they yep. think about. Yeah. Absolutely. And they don't give a f about the animals having their yeah, rights absolutely. violated. Absolutely. They absolutely do not have a right. Like, this is what makes me laugh about you vegans. Just eat the goddamn chicken what? if you want chicken. If the animal didn't want to be killed, then figure out a way around it. If you really believe in your principles, then die for them. Starve to death. Why aren't you vegan? Is I'm this your daughter farmer. here? Here you go. Where are you from, America? Yes, American. You're American, and you farm here, or you farm in America? No, I was a farmer from nine to 17. Farming? Dairy. Oh, dairy farmer. Yes. Okay. So you're not vegan because you were a farmer when you were 17? When, I'm from... not vegan because I don't want to be. Because okay. I don't see the reason behind it. Because okay. if you were put in a situation where it was you and an animal and you had to survive at some point, you're going to choose that animal. Just like if you were trapped and your leg was stuck, at some point you're going to cut it off to save yourself because self-preservation will eventually come into play. Yeah, we're not going to disagree there. Once but we're again. not in that situation right now, are we? So what? Once again, why, I mean, animals are... Like, I, I had the ethical thing with myself about killing animals when I was nine years old, and then... And what, you just, you just tucked it away? It's not that I tucked it away, it's just, once again, it's a part of life. But it doesn't have to be, does it? It's been a part of life forever. Killing each other has too, but it doesn't have to be. Also. Okay, but it's still happening, and it's not going to stop. Yeah, but, but nothing my, you do. Uh, once again, I mean, to say you're why... vegan, you're using plastic tables, yeah, well, you're using okay. plastic we can get phones, into that. you're using cell phones. Let's go I get mean, into that. There's wait, wait, so wait, wait, many we... animal products that you're using okay. that you can't tell can me you're going about... to be a vegan and then go Just and be hypocritical about it all. Slow down, because we can talk about everything. Plastic. We're gish galloping around. You said it's always happened. We're always. It's always happened. Killing animals has always happened. I said so is killing humans. And then you went, ah, oh, well, plastic and this and that. I, I feel like we well, should stay on one topic the and product, then move on. The end you know product is all star. I mean, glue, crayons. Okay. Everything we use at some point is going to be a derivative of some kind of animal. Not everything at all. You need eating. evidence for that too. Listen, by the way. And also, once again, but, to get your vegetables and all your stuff out of the ground. Now we're going to crop deaths. Yes, loads but, but of crop I, feel, I feel like we're moving because along to. A up. cultivator doesn't just cultivate your vegetable, it cultivates the rabbits, the. Can mice, I answer one the of these rats, things? Can I answer insects? You, for you can a answer sec? anything you want. But you're moving from one thing to that. We went plastic, phone, crop deaths, glue. So, which one do you want to tackle first? We go with crop death. So this one, you really like this one, eh? Yeah, why not? All right. So what is the accusation against vegans, particularly for crop deaths? The food that you're eating is not going to be 100 per It's not going to be vegan because the animals that are being killed are going to be processed into the same plant. It's called fallen. It's, it's permitted. The FDA permits a certain fallen of whether it be cockroaches or rodents into whatever the product is. And it's going to have the same thing with your vegetables. When a cultivator goes through a field, it's not going to stop and say, oh, could you move, rabbit? Can you move? All that's getting cultivated to get your potato, to get your avocado, to get whatever. If you're going to use humans to pick it, then you're going to now have no, that's the, No, 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 no. We're staying on topic. Yes. That's... Crop deaths. I'll let you speak on crop deaths. You don't want to go to migrant workers and shit like that, and then we're going to go off and bloody space aliens and shit. Right. Oh, so, 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 okay. your your argument is it's not vegan because animals die in some processing of it. Yes, they all. And how do they die? Harvesters? Normally, painfully. No, I mean, like, what is a? You're saying harvesters run over these animals? Have you ever seen a, how a cultivator cultivates? Well, I've read the, the research on this. Yeah. Uh, I've well, actually driven the tractor. Okay. Well, um, and I've watched little animals get brought up and spit into the machine. Yeah, most of them run away. <laughs> Okay, so that's a good well, reason. Well, there's, re there's, there's research the, on it. So when you see six lines of a crop, or <clears throat> crop things all lined up, and they're all, you think they're getting away. Yeah. When we're there's all research on this. The, but they don't. There's research on this. And I can show they, you that. They literally... I can take you to Essex right now and show you the animals getting no, chopped you, up into the You cultivated. start up a harvester, mice start running. Yeah, they go down. They're into not the ground. Stupid. Where do you think, where do you think that cultivator is going? Into it the ground. It doesn't go into the ground. Oh, what? Well, you're so talk, you're talking your about carrots, when you... your tomato, uh, potatoes, they don't all come you're, out of the wait ground. Wait a second, are we talking about wheat here? No, not just wheat. You don't just cultivate okay, wheat, so you which cultivate plant are you talking other about? plants. Because vegetables. when you talk about a harvester, I'm thinking of this big combine harvester that rolls over a wheat field. Okay, but... So that combine harvester doesn't run over a tomato field. 
once again, to cultivate the ground, you have a plow that's going to so bind now up you're that. talking about plowing. Once again, it's that's the not same, it's all part of the farming no, 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 process no, you're, you're that gish-galloping. is going to, it's Brother, not, you're gish-galloping. once again, you we, will turn any of, subject no, around because that's no, no, the no, no, way no. All you I'm sell saying, your product. All I'm, I'm not selling anything. What do you think I'm selling? The vegan. You've got more vested interest in me in this than me because you want to keep eating meat, we'll which keep is why eating meat, irregardless yeah, yeah, of you're using crop dust as an excuse to continue eating meat. That's what you're doing. But I'm just saying no, that I'm when just you start using up, that as an example of when you start up, reason of something that's just hypocritical. One second. If when you start up a harvester, you you ever walk near a mouse? They run like. Away, have right? you been in the underground? I and, mean, and I've had mice re- come up to me done, <laughs> on the done, underground. They, they don't no, run excuse f- away. Excuse me, they run. No, they, they really they don't. Radio oh collared, they've done studies on this, and they radio collared mice, and only one out of the 30 that were radio collared, only one was run over by a harvester. Your claim is that all these animals are dying in harvesters, right? Forget harvest. Farming, in general, is going to process and kill animals. Do you have a problem with that? I have no problem at all with okay. it. Okay, so c- can I uh, explain the difference between protecting crops and raising chickens and slaughtering them to eat them? Can I explain the, the moral distinction there? Go for it. So if we don't protect our crops from insects, we will have mass starvation on Earth because the, the insect will mow through those crops, right? And we'll essentially, eventually, we'll starve. There's a difference between defending property, defending crops, right? and taking innocent beings, breeding them and slaughtering them for an unjustifiable reason. I'm talking about protecting crops, we have a justification. Eating their bodies, we don't. It's unjustifiable. And what's stopping the insect from eating the crop? Pesticide. So you're okay with pesticide? That are going to kill your animals through runoff and fish water. Dude, I am 100%- So you're perfectly okay with fish dying because of runoff from well, pesticides. Well, if you're worried about pesticide use, most of the pesticide I has been used don't. to grow... Once again, I honestly one second, one second, one second, one second, one second, one second, one second. If you're worried about pesticide runoff, 40% of the arable land in the UK is used to grow grains to feed to livestock animals, yeah? So if you're concerned about minimizing pesticide anyway, you should be eating a plant-based diet which uses way less pesticide because you have to feed a bunch of plants to, to grow a chicken. And pesticides are completely justified to prevent global starvation because insects can just mow through our crops without thinking. Yeah, I want to protect them. I'm not stupid. I don't, I don't say, hey, hey, come over here and come into my house and Our steal everything and steal all pretty much takes care of pest, um, nah. insects. I mean, I think there should be better ways, but we'll never find better ways of protecting animals whilst you're eating them because you don't actually care to change the system. Vegans actually care to change the system and protect animals. And you want to nail us for pesticide, of which animals use more of, and you eat animals anyway. Animals don't use any pesticides. Yes, Anim- they do. Humans use pesticides. No. Animals are there. Being fed products like soya, like oats, like corn. Yep, they're being fed an unnatural diet because we are now bulking them. Because yes. we, need to, we need to meet the demand with factory farms because everyone wants to eat meat, like yourself. Everyone wants bacon and chicken and cheese and yep. beef because Absolutely. they're selfish and greedy and that's all they yep. think about. Yeah? Absolutely. And they don't give a fuck about the animals having their yeah, rights violated. Absolutely. You know what I mean? So I don't think an animal but, has a right. But plant, at the end they, of the day, exactly, they, they absolutely do not have a right. Okay, and why not? Why should why they? Why should they? Because they are sentient beings. At the end of the day, we were all put here before all the arguments. This is how life has been. You go into a cage here, with a lion, have this debate with him, and you tell me how you come out. Lions rape each other. They kill, kill each other's yep. kids. Why Humans do I give a each other? Shit, man. Exactly. Be, probably statistically you speaking, okay? there's about 10 rapists you think it's standing okay? right in this you think group. It's okay? There's we... nothing you're going to do about it. I don't rape, though. I don't rape. I don't know what you do. I don't... I've never met you before. But I'm just saying. I'm taking your word for I... it. Like I said, I... I... statistically no, speaking, I don't want animals to be raped and killed. I don't want humans to be raped. Right here, there'll be murderers standing. Yeah, exactly. You're not going to change. But you're it. saying you're not because they change people, that's what we are. Are you finished? We are brought up as carnivores. We have teeth for a reason. What the f that got to do with rape? I'm saying that. Just because something exists and we can't stop it, like rape and murder, or li- you, you use go have an argument with a lion, why would I f- They're not a moral agent. They rape each other, they f- and kill cubs. Just because they do that, that doesn't justify Humans us doing kill it. their own offspring exactly. all the time. It's, is that okay? It's not, it's just it's not the way okay. It is. All right. It's not okay. It's, it's not okay. Is. What I'm it saying depends on is what just country because you're it, in, whether it's okay or not. No, it's wrong. No, it's it wrong in every country. What country you're it's in. And wrong in every country. It's always it's wrong. It's wrong in your mind. Other governments would disagree. Killing with you. kids is wrong. Killing kids uh, and children yeah, is wrong. It happens every single day. It, and it's wrong, and we shouldn't engage in it, is what I'm saying. I don't disagree that we shouldn't engage in it, okay. but it does happen. So just because something, ha- I don't care if there's a difference between something happens and it happens, and therefore we should engage in it. 
I'm saying just because something happens doesn't mean we should engage in it. Just because a lion does this doesn't mean we have to do this. You're saying we're natural carnivals? Is that what you said? Yes, absolutely. And what makes you think you're a natural carnival? Um, are you a lion, are you? Don't need to be a lion, dude. Like I said, at the end of the day, they're there. We've been eating meat. Meat has been You don't look like if a carnival. You, if you were put in a position where it became you and that animal and so you have your self-preservation was there, you are going to eat the animal. The animal will lose. If in you a survival start, situation. Absolutely. Are you in a survival so situation? So you're okay with killing an animal if you have to survive. but not I would just kill a again. human if I had to survive. Exactly. So Self-defense. Shoot him straight in the head. No problems with it. All right? Dude, because if, it, if because you were on an airline crash, I would eat you if I had to, dude. If it came down to it, I'd have no problem. Okay, I wouldn't it. eat you while you were still alive if you were innocent. But if you were trying to, to harm me, if you were trying to kill my family, or if I had a, if I was to protect my life, I would do self-defense, right? Once again. Now, what I'm saying is we don't have... So, that, if that's you're justified. okay with eating meat to save your own life, then, you know, if you really believe in your principles, then die for them. Starve to death. Well, if that's your principle, starve to death. Because well, if that pig's life, wait. So all of a sudden, me, that yeah. pig's life is only important to you when there's lots of pigs and loads of yeah. variety. I don't want to hold it right now, dude. When okay, there's loads of variety and what have you. Are you upset? No, I'm not upset at all. I really. Well, then I just, do this. Just, this, just this, this is kind of fun for me. Actually. Okay, good. All I'm saying is that. In a survival situation, we do many crazy things, right? That doesn't justify our behavior now. Once now, again, so you will justify your behavior if it's meant to what, survive. What am I justifying? Because I don't. I think you, you might have told, to... Once again, you said I will kill something. I said I'd kill have you to... if I had to. Once again, so it's self-defense. Yeah, if I had to protect my life. Your veganism is reliant upon whether or not you're hungry enough. Whether or not it's it. justified or unjustified, hundred percent. So if you were hungry enough to eat it, you would. No. If you had to. So if well, you were one of these nice homeless about? people that were sitting here and it came down to a hamburger no. or starving to death, you'd pick up the burger. In a situation where I'm going to starve to death and there's a burger there, one hundred percent I'm going to so eat the burger because I'm about to starve. I thought you were going to say he's a homeless guy. I know, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, 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 well, but, I mean, at but, the end of the day, lying? he might. But, but, bro, are you homeless? Are you in a situation when you're going to starve to death? I would not put No, no, no. I asked you a question. I asked you a question. Are you in a situation where you're going to starve to death? My. Yes or no? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't hear anything, but yes or no? Exactly. My are you in a situation where you're about to starve to death? No, not currently. No, then well, how do you justify killing and eating animals when you're not in that situation? Because I like the way they taste. Exactly. So because you derive pleasure from an action, does that then justify the action? I like pleasure, but yes. Yeah, taste is pleasure, right? That's what I mean. Life is pleasure, dude. No, I'm no, here, no. I get one turn. I'm not going to change for that. And once again, there's not much in this world that doesn't derive from some kind of... I don't derive pleasure from the murder of others. But you, I you certainly do. don't. Yeah. I would never you murder, do. purposely murder somebody, but if it came animals down are to... No, no murder no, of animal others, I mean animals is are absolutely others. not the Animals same. are others. No, listen, if it are came they? down to it, my house and me having to feed my child, I'd eat my dog if I had You're to. You're talking about crazy situations. It's I'm talking crazy. about here in London, dude. dude you don't have to kill London. anyone right now, or any animal. You could just be vegan. I'd f***ing rather cut my foot off than be a vegan. I'd I'd eat myself before I freaking sit around and eat vegetables, dude. Yeah, we, we got vegan burgers, dude. Do you rather eat your foot than dude, a vegan burger? So you, this is what makes me laugh about you, vegans. You want chicken so bad that you get processed, and you make it look like a piece of chicken, and then you eat it. Just eat the goddamn chicken what? if you want chicken. Pro processed KFC. I don't give a what you're talking about. We're, we're the only ones with processed. Most of the processed food is meat. You're right. You have a, like bacon and pastrami. It's all processed meat. So who gives a about process? Yeah, I, I eat that when I want to be unhealthy. Well, what I don't get is if you want to eat a piece of chicken, why make something look like a piece of chicken? Just I eat the bloody chicken. Spent the last chicken. hour telling you how I don't want to kill chickens, but I don't okay, mind. So I don't mind the taste of uh, the texture and taste of like meat products. So you should eat it for twenty six years. So are you life. okay with eating the uh, new now bio chicken that's grown in a lab? I wouldn't eat it for some reason, because it's animal tissue. So it uh, creeped me out. I don't have a moral issue with someone eating it though, because animals don't, aren't having their rights violated. They haven't been caused any suffering. Animal, let's so, get... So I think it's fine to eat morally, but I just, it's a bit icky for me. I see no distinction when it comes to animals having more rights than humans. Not more rights, just the right not to be slaughtered for a sandwich, not more rights. <laughs> Once again, if you didn't even want them to have the basic fundamentals. They're animals. Once again, we're they animals. should defend. You're right. And because we're a higher species of animal, we are therefore. We're superior, yeah? Yes. So we're superior, therefore we can do what we want to, aren't we? But we do. Pigs get gassed in gas chambers. Absolutely. And that's okay because we're superior? Once again, it happens. We're, every superior. Single day. we're a superior species. 
We're a superior race. If the animal didn't want to be killed, then figure out a way around it. At the end of the day, sick, we're taking Jeffrey it to Dahmer the police. Jeffrey can say that about killing children. If you don't want to be killed, figure out a way around it. I mean, it doesn't justify killing the innocent, does it? Once again, a, there are millions of people being killed every single day. And you don't animals. do it. You don't do it, do you? No, I don't. And but, you don't sit in and try to justify it for an hour, do you? But I did have to bring animals to slaughterhouses, and you know what? And when you were nine, how did you feel about it? The first time, it bothered me. The second time, it was a job. Sounded like a hitman. <laughs> Anyways. If a hitman pays me, then I'll do Take the care. Job. Thanks for sitting down. No worries, man. Thanks for Have being a good, a good sport. Day.